Hi everyone and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Glossy Box. It's the season to be glossy advent calendar. Finally, we're going to be opening this one. I am super, super excited because I know you guys love the Glossy Box calendar. Okay, so first up, this calendar is £70 for subscribers. If you're a subscriber to Glossy Box, you get it a little bit cheaper because it's £80 if you're not a subscriber. So you get £10 off. So I guess in a sense you may as well sign up because the box is £10. This calendar is worth over £350. So you're getting so many goodies inside. If you are a subscriber, you can already pre-order this, but it goes on general sale from today. This is what it comes like. It's very, very similar to last year's calendar and it's tied with a lovely bow. So let's open it up. It is like a big, massive present. This is how well gorgeous. Leave a little sparkle wherever you go. And as you can see, so it's very, very similar to last year's. I think the 25 last year was on the door. This time they've hidden it behind the number one. Number one is huge, such a big box. And as I said, number 25 is behind number one. This door, oh no. Keep an eye on the door, guys. <laughs> Okay, number one, let me get my booklet so I can tell you more as well about each product. Okay, so number one is the NYX Professional Makeup Ultimate Shadow Palette. This looks really lovely, actually. This is like my colours. Love it. I just love like neutral colours. Like it's an everyday palette. I love red tone browns. This is a full size. It's normally worth £16. And it says it has different satins and shimmers and metallic hues in it. So it is a bit of a mixture. It's really lovely. So I like that. Number two is here. You guys see that? Okay, I love these little boxes. They also, some of them have stuffing inside, as you can see. So I'm going to open it up the other way. So here we have the Chloe Nomad Eau de Parfume. I've never smelled this. I used to wear the Chloe Original Perfume. I really liked it. Such a cute little bottle. I'm scared this is gonna go everywhere. I'm going. It actually smells quite masculine, not gonna lie. Cute bottle though, I will give that a try. As I've said before, I'm very, very picky about perfumes, but I'll give it a try, it's so cute. And that is five mils. This is, this is worth 720, and the full size is normally 85 pounds. That's on my finger and that's all I'm gonna smell today. It does smell really masculine, okay. Get rid of this box. Number three is here, a big one. <gasps> What's inside? Oh, okay. This is a beauty sponge, exclusive blending sponge, a glossy box one. It's light pink, it feels really soft, but quite velvety. And they say this is a full size worth 10 pounds, but it's glossy box. So I guess we'll never really know the true value of the sponge, but yeah. So they say it's worth 10 pounds, but yeah, it feels nice. Or, is okay this is a nude stick so a makeup item in mistake is a lip and cheek pencil so it's a really pretty color very nude i don't know about wearing that as a cheek color i mean you could quite nice it's very glossy actually like a nice definitely a nice lip cream this is a full size and this is worth 20 pound 50 for this Five. All I can smell is that perfume now, and I've come to the decision that I don't like it. <laughs> it's alright, it's not bad, it's just not for me. Okay, number five is... I, open, I keep opening it at the wrong end because there's just so much stuffing. A Body Shop hand cream, so a mango hand cream in 30 mils. So this is worth five pounds, but it also says here that you may get a different one. So it could be Sweet Almond Tropical mango, fruity strawberry or wild argan. So wild argan, strawberry, mango or almond. So I've got mango. Number six is this big one. Every time I open it at the other end. Okay, this is, what is this? It's a brush from Luxie and it's a medium angled shading brush. It feels really soft, it feels really nice actually. This is full size and it's worth £9.50 and this is a vegan and cruelty free brand and so this is good for a smoky eye effect so you never have enough eye brushes but it does feel really really nice. For seven, 
Oh, what is this little sparkly thing? Okay, this is Ellie Splash Cosmetics Rosalite. This is a uh, eyeliner. This is a glitter eyeliner. The full size worth twelve sixty. And yeah, this is glitter eyeliner. I would say it's not full. I mean, it's full on glitter, but it's not full full on glitter for an eyeliner. I would say this is really good as like a glitter topper. So if I did my black eyeliner and then put that over the top because it's quite it's quite spaced out. It's not like really thick glitter line. It's quite thin. But it is a really nice rose gold colour. It's be very nice come Christmas time. Right, number eight is down here. And what we got? We have an MUA Pro Base Primer Oil with Gold Flakes. Hello. Oh, ooh, that looks so cool. This looks like the Guerlain Laura Primer, which is like one of my favourite primers, but so expensive. So this looks similar. So how much is this? This is a full size with four pounds. So really cheap because the girl I'm on is like 40 pounds or something like that. I am going to try this with my hands. See what it feels like. It feels nice. Oh, it does feel like really hydrating actually. What does it say? It doesn't really say anything about what's in it. Let's have a little look. This is a primer oil. So it's more of like an oil. Yeah, so the girl I'm on is more like a kind of primary gel i think this is more an oil which is really lovely to be honest i like that the nine not to be confused with six number nine uh is oh, every time open it at the right end <gasps> this one's wrapped up okay i'll turn my little booklet as well okay, number nine is the mitchell and peach bath oil so if you got the glossy box the last month, which was a delicious box, they had, I think, the Mitchell and Peach perfume in it. I wasn't a fan of it. So this is the bath oil. Which doesn't smell as strong as the perfume. But yeah, that is a little mini 15 ml. So this is worth £8.5 and a full size is normally £46. So if you love the smell, then you're in for a treat. But for me, I'll pass on that one, I think. Ten. The Sleek Match Me Matte Lip Cream in Birthday Sleep. This is actually one of the best colours of this. I already have this and it's really nice. It is a little bit drying, I would say, the Sleek Mattes, but they're nice for the price. So they're $4.99 and that's a full size. They're on number 11. Where are you? You're here. This is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day in shower styler and this is a 30 ml and it says this is a deluxe mini worth five pounds and the full size is normally 21. so this is a brand new product from them so i think the idea of it is do you use it yeah you use it in the shower on clean wet hair and then you coat from roots to ends lightly rinse towel dry yeah so it's instead of drying your hair it helps to just keep any frizz at bay and you can just scrunch dry your hair which i've always wanted to try because my hair is actually super curly, but I just always wave it myself. I never would let it dry just because it, it's just like a riot, basically. So I might try this and see what it's like. It's probably a product that would be better maybe in summer. My hair just takes ages to dry. I think that's why I never let it air dry either. It just takes so long because I have quite thin hair, but it's like I have loads of it. So it just takes ages, but that's what it is. So if you don't normally dry your hair, then it's a really great product. Right, 12 is here. And we have, what is this? Winky Lux Uni Brow Universal Brow Pencil. Oh, so it's got a spoolie on one end. And then it has the colour on the other end. This is a bit like the Dior one. So basically it works with like your skin tone to kind of get the perfect brow shade. And to be honest, that looks really good for me to be honest this is a full size and it's normally worth 15 pounds i'm really really excited about this one 13 where are you so this little guy i'm lucky for some but lucky for me because this is guys wrapped up <laughs> i am so excited for this this is a dr dennis gross professional grade ipo dark spot serum and I am so excited for this because I haven't tried this yet. 
I love Dr. Dennis Gross Skincare. It's one of my absolute favorite brands. I love brands that really work, like Varad and Dr. Dennis Gross and Image Skincare that I've mentioned before. Just really, really great brands like that. Like my skin just like soaks it up. So I'm excited to try this. So this is good for if you have any dark spots, so like pigmentation. It's got like acid, it's got like a kind of cocktail of acids. So it's lagosorbic acid, lactic acid, and licorice root. So basically it reduces the appearance of dark spots. So I'm so excited for this. This is a seven mils, so it'd be worth 23 pounds because the full size is only 30 mils and it's worth 100 pounds. So yeah, I haven't tried it yet because to be honest, I only really have like two sort of small dark spots that I didn't really want to splash out and get like a hundred pound bottle of like a dark spot serum because I was sort of using like vitamin C and melanol to kind of see if that would shift it. So I'm very excited to be able to give it a try now. 14 is down here. Oh, 14 wrapped up. I like that they're wrapped up. Okay, this is a Mina Cream Eyeshadow in 313 Light Brown. Now this just looks absolutely stunning. <gasps> so, so nice. It's so nice, guys. I like the texture of this feels so creamy and milky. It reminds me a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury eye pots. And also maybe now the new Victoria Beckham ones, I haven't played with them, I haven't seen them in real life, but from what I've seen online, it's kind of similar. So, oh, so shiny, that's so beautiful. This is a full size and it's worth $12.95. Uh, I can't wait to try that, so nice. <laughs> okay, 15, I can still smell that perfume. Okay, 15 is, what is this? Cura Prox BU Candy Lover enzymatic whitening bacterial balance is this toothpaste yeah bu candy lover toothpaste so it has a watermelon flavor and it helps to kind of make teeth whiter and fights bacteria so i have heard of cure products actually because i have a little like interdental type thing that's by them that i have from the dentist so this is worth three pound ten and a full size is normally 13.95 Okay, 16 is a Nude by Nature, I like this brand, Touch of Glow Highlight Stick. And this is like a like, deluxe mini, so a really pretty kind of colour. So this is worth £9 and it's normally 18 so it's like half the size. And it's got all natural ingredients in it and like vitamin E, Kaduka Plum, Kaduka Plum, hello. So... That looks really pretty. I like that. I'll give that a try. And that's in the colour, well, I had the colour 01 Champagne, so I don't know if there's going to be different colours, but that's one I have. 17 is this big one. I feel like this is like a VHS recorder and we're putting it in. Okay, this is the Rituals, Rituals Secure and Magic Touch Body Cream. I think this is in like every calendar always. Um, organic Rice Milk and Cherry Blossom. I think I like this. I'm pretty sure I do. I can't remember. So this is a deluxe mini worth £8.41 and it's normally eighteen fifty. Number 18 is, I know this guy, this is Dr. Popo and this is a 10 mil. So this is a deluxe mini worth £3.95. It's normally worth £6.95 and yeah, it's just a multi-purpose BAM. So this is just like the original clear version. Always great just to have, have it in your handbag. 19. is Avon Hyaluronic Yojoba Oil Avocado Pro Intense Hyaluronic Acid Illuminating Day Cream 50 ml. So this is a full size. No. This is a full size, guys. Guess how much this is? This is 98 pounds. 98 pounds. This is dearer than the calendar. It comes out like a blue color. Does it highlight? doesn't have a smell, which is good. I hate products that are really fragranced. Ooh, definitely. Oh, it feels nice. It feels hydrating. Okay, so maybe like the MUA oil. No, this than the MUA oil. That could be a nice little combo. We're on 20. I'm really excited. I love multi-brand calendars. Multi-brand calendars are my favourite kind of calendars. Um, Because I haven't actually unboxed one yet. Apart from latest and beauty, but I really count it as an unboxing because obviously you guys saw why I couldn't. So yeah, this is a blush palette from Barry M. Beautiful colours. 
So we've got a glittery shade and then kind of like neutral shades and then like a peachy one. So this is full size and this is only $5.99. is, I can still smell that perfume. Oh my God. Do you know what? You know when you spray a perfume and sometimes like it just disappears? No, it's, I can smell it everywhere. I didn't even, do you know I didn't even spray it? I only got it on my finger. That's why it's really masculine, like really aftershavey. Okay, <laughs> number 21 is Demologica's Super Fungly In. This has been in a lot of calendars before. Um, It's a really good product. I don't really use it, but I know that a lot of people love it. One is a deluxe mini worth $17.50 and a full size is £55.22. Is, oh, Kat Von D Tattoo Liner. Always wanted to try this, never tried it. Oh, it looks good. This looks nice. Ooh, it goes on really well. It's like a felt tip, but it feels quite fine, like kind of nearly a paintbrush. But I like that. I've never tried this. I can't believe I've never tried this before. So that's a little mini version. So this is worth 6 18 and the full size is normally worth £17. 23 is really good boxes a steve laurent lip gloss so i remember i think it was glossy box it was a steve laurent product in it before last year so this is cherry lip gloss and it's very very glittery um i don't know we'll have to give it a try so that's a full size and that's worth 17.33 a4 nearly done wrong end again for this mega wrapped up what is inside here 24 is a nails ink polish in golden days ahead um great that it's a polish because it's full size it's worth 11 pounds but i personally don't like that color i wish it had been red instead but it's very 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 christmasy i guess i know what this is you probably know what it is. And um, yeah, this is really good. Okay, 25 is the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Palette. And I love this. And I can genuinely say I love this because I already have it. <laughs> I, I bought it a couple of years ago, actually. So I actually thought it was limited edition. I didn't know you could still get it, but you can. So look how gorgeous this is. Look at this. So it's basically a contour palette, but I actually used it as an eyeshadow palette and I still use it. So it's just super gorgeous. It says on the mirror, chiseled like a diamond. So you could just use it even as a mirror. And it has some lighter shades and then darker shades for contours. It's a contour and highlight palette. And this is worth £40, but so, so pretty. And if I didn't have this already, I would be slightly more excited. But just because I do have it, it's not as exciting for me. But I think that's really, really good. So that is inside. It's the season two be glossy. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Personally, I like this calendar much more than I thought it was gonna. When I read the content, I wasn't sure, but I actually really like a lot of it. Like the, I would be way impressed by that palette if I didn't already have it because it's amazing. I love Tarte and I think that palette is just like so nice. Like I think if you're buying this as a gift for like, your daughter or something like they should be blown away by that like i think that's so good uh favorite products for me were like the dr dennis gross serum because i really wanted to try it the mina eyeshadow um i think there are a few filler type products like the pawpaw and stuff like that but apart from that there are some really good ones like the kaplan d liner and i guess obviously some of them were like more expensive so we had that like 98 pound moisturizer that's like full size so it's a good mixture of like a little bit more high end a little bit like a uh, drugstore high street whatever you want to call it like products there's a good mixture of makeup perfume a little bit of everything just a bit like a boxy really so yeah I, I quite liked it so let me know what you thought of it in the comments what did you like the best what did you not like Give this video a like, make sure you hit subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.